Hey y'all, hey y'all. <laughs> How y'all doing? Okay, I'm back now with this um, second part of the fourth <clears throat> Nazarene Emerald Tablet. So I'm going to put it in a playlist. So if you watch it, it should have, you should be able to see the first part and then just connect the two together. I'm only going to do about 10 minutes so I don't get tongue tied. And um, <clears throat> I might not have read this before, so if I start stumbling, yeah, sorry. Okay, here's, oh, no, no, I'm sorry. We were down in precept 11, because the first part ends. Is that the golden precepts of Herman with commentary <clears throat> by of thoughts. Okay, we were right here. <clears throat> This is so cool that I'm doing this right now is because I was just carving my walking stick. Stick. I found my walking stick um, about four or five years ago when I was with my son, and it was just in the park, and it's perfect. It has a handle and everything. So I just I I've been working on it for years, and I didn't know what I wanted to put on it. But since I've been reading the Megillah, I um, got some ideas so this is good that I'm reading this today it's actually like real time for me the staff of healing of the sun temple <clears throat> I carry the staff of the of healing of the sun temple that is a co conventional Nazarene staff featuring spiraling ascend ascending herbage often a variety of vines with leaves flowers and or fruits this vine Imagery is typically carved into the wood with the sun with wing with wing symbol carved at or near the top of the staff. Some artists place the sun at the center of a symbolic heart. Others place a symbolic heart within the disc of the sun. Feel free to be creative in designing your own staff, adding perhaps gemstones. <clears throat> like this is the blueprint, yo. <laughs> oh my freaking life. It's so crazy or other natural elements, even while keeping the conventional theme of the Nazarene staff. This staff that I now hold, the Staff of Healing of the Sun Temple, is known in many worlds and is the particular staff of the tribe of healers of the Nazarene religions of the Essene way. Because Essene means healer. If you go in the earlier videos, it has the breakdown. Uh, commentary of Thoth on Precept 11 of Hermon. <coughs> okay, so this is Thoth's commentary. I need some water right quick. I'm sorry. The serpent priesthood mocks us of the true sun temple by, by forming a false sun temple. They replaced the spiral of herbage ascending the staff with two spiraling serpents. By that symbol, they offer human and animal sacrifice to their false god and to the ultimate Satan. That is the way of Satan. Behold, any demonic entity might repent and eventually become angelic by change beliefs, change behaviors, change thoughts, words, and deeds. That is why we teach that the ultimate Satan is a satanic path itself, which we call the way of Satan, a path that once let out <clears throat> of the bag of potential into actualization <clears throat> long ages ago, persisted as long as there are beings walking that path. One second. Actually, I'm sorry. <clears throat> A path that once let out of the bag of potential into actualization long ages ago persists as long as there are beings walking that path and thus actualizing it. But even the satanic way can become unactualized. That will happen when no beings walk that way. The true heavenly sun beings that reside in the temple of light in the spiritual realm, the seventh heaven of our solar system, are of the nod of wisdom to love and believe not in <clears throat> the practice of vicarious atonement through animal sacrifice and or human sacrifice of the body of the bloody altars of the serpent priesthood and their like. Golden Precept 12 of Herman, the wizards of the staff of healing of the sun temple. Within the Green Wizards of White Magic is, a, is an order of trained healers. Gilgala was one, as I, I am. 
most Nazarene wizards practice in at least several tribes within the nation of Yisrael, often including the tribe of healers. Commentary of thought on Precept 12 of Hermon. For example, consider Wizardess Gigala. She is simultaneously of the tribe of priesthoods, the tribe of song and words, the tribe of healers, the tribe of lions, the tribe of farmers, and who would deny that she also embodies the traits of other tribes as well. <clears throat> Golden Priest of 13 of Hermon. Blood, sacrifice, and black magic. Every act of animal or human sacrifice intended to appease or otherwise please a deity or purchase atonement is an act of black magic. <clears throat> Commentary of Thoth on Priest of 13 of Hermon. Bloody sacrifice is based on wrong understanding, and that's uh, understandings about life, the use of will and deity. Golden Precept 14 of Hermes, of Hermon. Avoid black magic practices. Black magic practices include the following types and should be avoided <clears throat> by beings that choose spiritual ascension and ever expanding goodness. One, dark necromancy, which is any form of communication with disembodied spirits for any purpose that is less than Christ-like, and by any <laughs> methods that are less than Christ-like, vicarious atonement via animal or human sacrifice, capture of any being disembodied or embodied to bind or enslave them to your will, unethical compulsion, conjurations fueled by lower vibrations, including the fuels of hatred, envy, vengeance, resentment, vainglory, ignorance, false control, greed, and various other dark things. Using alchemical principles in perverted ways for profit at the expense of the well-being of Mother Nature and her creatures. Misusing the chief four elements of the garden of the light or other less obvious elements in perverted green magic. Scurrying or otherwise practicing divination or any other intentional acts of magic for less than noble reasons. Commentary of Thoth on Precept 14 of Hermann. Notice that Herman said that black magic includes the items on that list. So the list is not intended to include every possible type of black magic, but to list many common practices of black magic, the intentional use of language arts to invoke selfish and or other dark acts is a common practice of black magic and is practiced on a large scale by the worldly powers and those that secretly pull their strings. <clears throat> You hear that the intentional use of language arts to invoke selfish and or other dark art acts. Now, <clears throat> that's why we have <clears throat> words that sound the same but are spelled different. And that's why it's called spelling. And I'm going to leave it there. Um, but, um, yeah. Okay. Often. The Serpent Priesthood is the Unseen Puppeteer. Oh, I'm getting ready to hit 10 minutes. Ooh, I think I'm going to leave it there and end it because that was a lot. And I'll make a part three to that because I don't want to go over 10 minutes. All right, y'all. Stay tuned. This is Juicy. <laughs> yeah. Represent. S-O-T-L. Yeah. Kane on the track, yeah, here we go, that's how we walk, you know I say represent Jesus, yeah, cause when we walk, when we walk, yeah, come on. Here we go. I wanted to die, my sleep, that's what I used to say. But now I wanna die, my feet battle demons, I pray. For the strength to survive, the will to be alive with God as my God, He leads to the prize. We walk in a world, anything less is absurd. For only God will I spit these nouns and proverbs. We kick off from the curb, now we banging the streets. Steady hanging, not slanging, but banging these beats. Heard a millennium, homie, it's a time to teach. Jesus will have returned, spiritual bodies released. At the end, it's the beast let loose from the lead. 
Haitian woke to the earth, you can't call the police. It's over from the spring to the end of October. Five months time, you better know Jehovah. He told you in the manuscripts and folders, does the teacher teach you? He just bore you. It's about to be a war, it's about your spirit. When we walk, when we walk, we don't mess around. Lord Jesus, bless the ground. When we walk, when we walk, when we walk, we don't mess around. Lord Jesus, bless the ground. When we walk, when we walk, when we walk, we don't mess around. Lord Jesus, bless the ground. When we walk, when we walk, when we walk, we don't mess around. Lord Jesus, bless the ground. When we walk, you think it's all about you, homie? Let me tell you something. Under the sun, nothing new done. So you need to stop for your lyrics. I handcuff it, egotistical soul. Cause I'm like Bram Muffin talking so much crap, homie. I'm flushing. Holla at me, cousin. You acting hard like you're southern. But is will like a city, you my brother, and you're smothering yet yeah, just another man, one like Satan, who took a stand, Gabel, you fell with him in hell's lake, waiting, lyrics are penetrating, children are intaking, all the lies and deception that you're making, lying on tracks while you raping the souls down, breaking the whole ground, most of both and brag, get back, dragged and smacked down. By their own words, return the devil serve, you turn on his curve, you speak his proverb, you just